Hello everyone, and welcome back to the Stanley Parable. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? They sure were Stanley gone. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Oh, no inputs? Uh, why, why are all the computers dead? When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Okay. What if we did that and then, like, disobeyed him? Okay. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. No. Let's try that again. The meeting room. Yes, that's where everyone would be. What, huh? What? Stanley just needed to get to the meeting room, and from then on, he would never be alone ever again. Uh, what? Uh, uh, okay. Um, gotcha. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. I don't like that. Yet, there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. What if, what if I try that again? Uh, um, uh... All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Um, Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. This is new. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. What if we do that again? Um... Contacting the Future Happiness Foundation. The hell? We are confirming your shipment of 1,327 cardboard boxes to your place of work. The Can you verify that this is correct? Um. Yeah. Excellent. Your order will arrive shortly. What Thank the you again heck? for contacting the Future Happiness Foundation. Okay, yeah, I don't remember this. What the fuck? That was weird. Uh, that was really weird. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. What happens if we go to the meeting room now? Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. What if I just didn't? And what's going to happen now? Um, I can't wait to tell this story to my co-workers, Stanley thought. How amusing they'll find it. Oh, won't we all just laugh and laugh at the time I thought everyone had gone missing? This is new. Um. Is... Uh, all right, well, okay. Uh. Huh, um... How, how many cardboard boxes did we order? When Stanley came to a I don't know if I should laugh doors, at this or be incredibly afraid. Left. 
I'm kind of jumpy right Yet, now. Yet there was not a single person here tell. either. Feeling a wave of disbelief. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Maybe I did. Oh, the boxes are gone. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. No. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Is that is that all where that goes? When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office, hoping he might find an answer there. But what if he just didn't? That was so weird. Like, I'm still like... Just a step through this door, Stanley thought to himself. Uh -huh. That's all I need. If I can make it through this door, I can make it through them all. Uh... Every time he says something different, it creeps me out just a little bit. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. No. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Standing now in this incredible room, Stanley for the first time understood true happiness. Then the feeling went away, and he felt sad again. Then it came back, and lingered for a minute or two. Uh, now it's only half there. Just a kind of, um, tingle. That's disturbing. What if I did it again? It's back. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? What does any Stanley of mean? decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. It's like this new office. Like, what? All right. Stanley went around touching every little thing in the office, but it didn't make a single difference, nor did it advance the story in any way. So I could say I got the whiteboard ending. Whatever that means. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door on his left. What if I, um, just went This back was not the, the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Sure did, buddy. Stanley felt lightheaded, butterflies in his stomach. Giddy in a way he had never known before. Was it this room? A connection between the two? Could a man love a room? I mean, what? truly, truly deeply, madly, love. I mean, could it? Only yes, one. really, really worth it being here in the room. A room so utterly captivating that even though all your co-workers have mysteriously vanished, here you sit looking at these chairs and some paintings. Really worth it. I mean... If a man loves a room... All of his co-workers were gone. What, what could, could it, it mean? mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. But what if Stanley didn't go to the to the to the meeting room, not the meeting room, uh, and just 
it's a little dimmer here than I remember. This isn't... When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, no, this was didn't. not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. I sure did. The lounge was grand, majestic, perhaps too majestic. Like a combination of a much smaller version and a much larger version of this exact room. What? It all made Stanley uncomfortable, and he started to bleed a little. What? This made him smile. At oh. last, proof that he was human. Uh... When Stanley came to a set of no, two open didn't. doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Is Stanley, Stanley knew parable perfectly like well. A psychological Perhaps he wanted to stop really by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. And here it was, the lounge. What a room, Stanley thought to himself. What a room, what a room, what a room. This is what Stanley thought. What a room. What a room, what a room. What a room. Va va voom. What a room. <laughs> uh. Yes. Yeah, I know. Um. Every All of his co workers were gone. Me out a little bit. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go be? to the meeting room. When Stanley came to a set uh, of two open doors, he, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, like you're just, just getting, to admire like, it. Like, closer and closer to making it was a okay. choice. It, it, it was okay? That, that's all you gotta say? Huh. When Stanley came to a set no, of two didn't. open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Sure did. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. It was okay. Is, is that all you got to say about it now? Okay, if it happens one more time, I'm going to keep walking. All of his co-workers were gone. What could, what could it, it mean? Be? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. And so the whole thing with like the meeting room and never being alone again, that is that was like kinda creepy. <laughs> like every time I hear about like loneliness and shit like that, I think of like Neon Genesis Evangelion. An anime that I have never watched, but I have heard like various things about its uh themes of loneliness. When Stanley came to a set of two open sure doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting he room, knew it. and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire <clears throat> it. It was okay. <laughs> but funny, eager though. to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. No, he did not. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. It really is, huh? Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot Maybe here. Maybe we did. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. But in his eagerness to prove that he is in control of the story uh. and no one gets to tell him what to do, Stanley leapt from the platform and plunged to his death. Good job, Stanley. Everyone thinks you are very powerful. That was an ending. I, I, All uh, of his it was an ending. Were gone. What could it mean? Stanley could decided it mean? to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Now I know that everyone's going to be like begging for me to do, oh, the broom closet ending, but we've all seen that before. When Stanley came I'm to trying my best to find the things the that I have never seen meeting before. Room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Even if they Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee bit. lounge first, just to admire it. Please. It was okay. That was a very depressing way to end that whole ordeal.
But eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. That's where you'd be wrong. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. God damn it. has gotta be something. It's gotta be something new. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong foot here. Is that place I'm over not your there. enemy, really, I'm not. And then I realize that, that investing your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you all this time. Maybe you're right. There's someone you've been neglecting, but Stanley. Fuck you. What? Really? Uh-huh. I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Maybe. Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Why? I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you, to show you something beautiful. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. God damn it. I'm trying my best to, like, find any new content. Something I haven't seen before. Even if it mildly terrifies me. Now listen carefully, this is important. Stanley walked through the red door. No, he didn't. Aha. Perhaps you misunderstood. Maybe. Stanley walked through the red door. Nice. I still don't think we're communicating properly. Stanley walked through the red door. No. All right, fine. Go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out what lies at the end of this road? <coughs> yes, I do. You've chosen well. Don't let me stop you. You see? There's nothing here. I haven't even finished building this section of the map. Because you were never supposed to be here in the first place. Really Broken to... rooms, exposed developer textures. Is this what you had wanted? I mean, was I it like worth this ruining the, the stuff, entire yeah? story I had written out specifically for you? Do you not think I put a lot of time into that? Because I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. Where's what the would have made this game better? New what content. did you want to see? Vehicles? Skill trees? Work with me. You've given me absolutely nothing so far. Tell you what. Let me take a stab in the dark at a new design and you can give me some feedback. Mm. There we go. A third option. This already feels leaps ahead of where we were before. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for a spin. Okay, I'm going to stop you there. Now, tell me about your experience with this new version. Terrible. Would you say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? No, I didn't. Feel free to be honest. I'm looking for some real critical feedback here. No, I don't. Uh, one? I mean, I can understand if you had reservations, you saw ways the game could be improved to more fully express itself mechanically and artistically, but a Ten one? Years. That's not even helpful. What am I supposed to do with that? Make it better. Uh, but I guess it isn't my place to judge. Here, based on the data from your previous playthrough, I've compiled a new version. Where's the and new to be content? Perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. New Let's content. Take a look. What? Okay, what if we actually took this third door? Now, would you say that competitive leaderboard helped you feel motivated to keep walking through doors? I mean... Again, honest answers, please. Before I just did it because, like, you know, um... Like, for shits and giggles, but, like, what the fuck is a leaderboard gonna do? Hey, I nearly forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and now would be a lovely opportunity to give it some playtesting. You wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Thanks. Perfect. Let me boot it up. In this game, the baby crawls oh, left towards kidding. danger. You click the button to move you've him back be to the right. Me. And if he reaches the fire, you you've fail. Be kidding it's me. a very meaningful game. I'm not doing All about this. the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demands of family life. I think the art world will really take notice. But of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. I... So why don't you give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective? Be sure to keep notes on your experience. I'm not doing this for four hours. We all know I'm not doing this for four hours. You heartless bastard. 
Did you do it because you hate babies or purely to spite me? I mean, because if it's what's the latter, fine to me? I don't know what to do. I'm completely out of no, ideas. No, like seriously. I can't he, he think of a single exact thing, thing that might He's improve fine. the experience for me. I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. It's over. Thank you for playing. Your input was extremely valuable. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? Just to ease the pain. Let's see. What do we have here? I wonder if you're able to use... If they're still able to yes. use Minecraft. This seems like it'll work. Let's give because it a like, shot. Because before we would just like transport over to Minecraft. Aha! Fire what? What do you think this game is Holy about? Holy shit! What's our backstory? What is our motivation? Hmm. Fucking well, Firewatch! You are meant to play as a creepy man spying on innocent civilians below you from up high in your That is not tower. what Firewatch was some about. Sort of twisted erotic purpose. That was not what mm. Firewatch was yes, about. That must be it. What a fascinating venture into the experience of total mental depravity. So far, I love, I love Firewatch. everything about this game, Stanley. And it seems there's even more. Come, let's venture outward and see what else is out there. Oh, do I fuck. They still use the Minecraft sound effect. There's a little bit of a callback. That's nice. God, I love Firewatch. I didn't think they would, they would reference it here. Oh no, 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 no! It can't be. It is. It's an open world game. Good God! Quickly, block it off. Wait, what? No, no. <sighs> Thank goodness, Stanley. What a close call. I hate you. I nearly wandered off into that... that... thing. I... That big, open, just wandering around, no right or wrong directions. Two no of my favorite video you. games are Breath of the any... Wild and Marvel's oh, Spider-Man. Oh, 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 thank heavens we avoided it. I hate you so we're much. We're out of the woods now, Stanley. I wish okay, we were in the I'm woods. I'm going to get us out of here. Let's find another game. God Preferably damn it. Preferably something with walls. Something with nice, big... Insurmountable walls. Let me out. Mm -hmm. Please. Mm -hmm. okay. I appreciate the Firewatch reference, so will be just the thing. I heavily appreciate that. Ro <laughs> Wonderful. See, this Rocket is exactly League, what I had holy in mind. fuck. Just a nice big box for you to run around in. There isn't any possibility that you could get lost here. Now this is game design. Yeah, Still, but where's the, to get lost where's the RC game, cars? I will be phenomenally um, impressed. I, it is kind of nice to walk around okay, this place so what instead exactly of driving do we around do here? it. Let's see. There are lots of cars here in the back, but obviously there's no racetrack. Okay, I'm seeing that there's a ball of some kind back here. Oh is my this god, game it's fucking sports rocket ball. Me. Stanley, I think it's sports ball. Oh, nah, what fun. Nah, we shall run I, the bases and do a touchdown that's together. That's not how you play Rocket yes, League. I think surely we must. Okay, Stanley. Oh, here's dude, the ball. I love Rocket Have fun. League. I don't like playing it competitively because I'm I'm not good at that kind of thing, but like I love Rocket League. Are you doing it? Are you winning? Is this fun? Uh, Is it better than my miserable little story that I work so hard on? It's new Stella, content. Thought, I'm taking it. And I realize I'm not a sportsologist, but if one ball generates a certain amount of raw Wait, no. adrenal pleasure, then don't surely do it. multiple balls don't do it. makes for an even more no, euphoric don't. sports experience. No, seriously. No, don't. Here comes another ball. Uh-huh. Yes. Oh, goodness, that really does feel amazing, doesn't it? Stanley, I'm like a child in a confectionery shop. I simply have to have more. I'm insatiable. More balls. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. Ooh. You sure did put more... Be sure that we put a lot more balls into it. You know, when I was playing, when I was watching Mark play the Stanley Parable years ago, I was like, you know, this game needs Stanley? more balls. You having fun? Is this a real video game? Well, I sure hope you're having a good time because guess what? It's over. Hold on. What are you Wait, doing? Uh, I didn't realize. Stanley, don't do that. I can't follow you there. I can't help you. How will you write a story without me? You can't do it, you know that. You'd be surprised. You? Uh... 
This isn't what I wanted. I'm afraid. Just wander here forever? Fuck that. All of his co-workers were... Wait, no. This isn't the right office, is it? Wait, no, yes is it is. Is this this office? Uh, it... Is it not? I mean, it looks pretty alright to me. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, he entered the door and this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. It was okay. <laughs> but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. I want to see what would have happened if we kept going. I didn't... I didn't Stanley know that. Stanley was so then. bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Look, Stanley, I think perhaps we've gotten off on the wrong Maybe foot. Maybe we have. I'm not your enemy, really, I'm not. Maybe you're not. I realize that investing in your trust in someone else can be difficult, but the fact is that the story has been about nothing but you. What? Really? I was in the middle of something. Do you have zero consideration for others? Are you that convinced that I want something bad to happen to you? Why, I don't know how to convince you of this, but I really do want to help you, to show you something beautiful. Look, let me prove it. Let me prove that I'm on your side. Give me a chance. Now listen carefully, this is important. Stanley walked through the red door. No, he didn't. Aha, perhaps you misunderstood. Stanley walked he did. through the red door. I still don't think we're communicating properly. All right, fine, go ahead, Stanley. You want to know so badly what's out there? You want to find out what lies at the end of this road you've chosen? Well, don't let me stop you. Yep. You see? There's nothing here. I haven't even finished building this section God, of the map because you were never you know, supposed to be here in the first fire, place. Fire Broken rooms, exposed League. developer textures. Is this what you had wanted? Was it worth ruining the entire story I had written out specifically for you? Do you not think I put a lot of time into that? Because I did. And in the end, it was all for nothing. Because this is what you wanted to see. Help me here, Stanley. Help elucidate these strange and unknowable desires of yours. What would have made this game better? What did you want to see? Vehicles? Skill trees? Work with me. You've given me absolutely nothing so far. Tell you what. Let me take a stab in the dark at a new design and you can give me some feedback. There we go. A third option. This already feels leaps ahead of where we were before. Go ahead, Stanley. Take it for I'll a spin. I'll take the middle one. Okay, I'm going to stop you there. Uh -huh. Now, tell me about your experience with this new version. Would you Maybe. say that the game benefited from allowing you more choices? Did it Feel now. free to be honest. I'm looking for some real critical feedback here. Maybe. A one? I mean, I can understand if you had reservations, you saw ways the game could be improved to more fully express itself mechanically and artistically, but a one? That's not even helpful. What am I supposed to do with that? Make it better. Uh, but I guess it isn't my place to judge. Here, based on the data from your previous playthrough, I've compiled a new version. And to be perfectly candid, I think I've knocked it out of the park with this one. Let's take a look. Now, would you say that competitive leaderboard helped you feel motivated to keep walking through doors? Again, no. honest answers, please. Hey, I nearly forgot. I've got a prototype of a new game I've been working on, and now would be a lovely opportunity to give it some playtesting.
You wouldn't mind taking a look at it, would you? Perfect. Let me boot it up. In this game, the baby crawls left mm -hmm. towards danger. You click the button to move him back to the right. And if he reaches the fire, you fail. Not it's a very meaningful it. game. All about the desperation and tedium of endlessly confronting the demands of family life. I think the art world will really take notice. But of course, the message of the game only becomes clear once you've been playing it for about four hours. So why don't you give it four hours of play to make sure it's effective? Be sure That's to possible. keep notes on your experience. You heartless bastard. Did you do it because you hate babies or purely to spite me? Because if it's the latter, well, I don't know what to do. I'm completely out of ideas. I can't think of a single thing that might improve the experience for me. I'm not even going to try. I'm out. I'm out. I'm done. It's over. Thank you for playing. Your input was extremely valuable. Oh, hey, since my game was so awful, why don't we play someone else's game? Just to ease the pain. Watch. Let's see. What do we have here? I really like Firewatch. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Yes. This seems like it'll work. Let's give it a shot. Aha! Fascinating. <laughs> what do you think oh this God, game is I about, I, I just didn't What's see it coming, story? okay? What is our motivation? Hmm. Well, it seems obvious to me that you are meant to play as a creepy man spying on innocent civilians below you That's from disgusting. up high in your You're creep disgusting. tower. Perhaps for some sort of twisted erotic purpose. Hmm. You are disgusting. Yes, that must be it. What a fascinating venture into the experience of total mental depravity. So far, I love everything about this game, Stanley. And it seems there's even more. Come, let's venture outward and see what else is out there. And I can't believe that you're going to close it off from me, bastard. Oh no. No, 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 it can't be. It is. It's an open world game. Good God, quickly block it off. I hate oh. you. Thank goodness, Stanley, what a close call. You nearly wandered off into that, that thing. A big, open, just wandering around, no right or wrong directions, no path to follow. You can just go in any... Uh. Oh, thank heavens we avoided it. We're out of the woods now, Stanley. I hate you. Okay, I'm going to get us out of here. I hate you Let's find another so game. Preferably something with walls. Something with nice, big, insurmountable walls. Why are you like this? <laughs> okay. I think this will be just the thing. By the way, while I while we've been like backtracking so we could like see what Wonderful. The, uh, see this is exactly what, what I had in mind. Is all about just this. a nice big I've box for you to run around in. To, there isn't any possibility to that you could get lost here. Of now this that just came is out today. game design. Stanley, if you manage at least I, to get at least lost I hope it's come out I will be phenomenally use. impressed. Okay, so what exactly do we do here? Let's see. There are lots of cars here in the Let's back, but obviously see. there's no racetrack. Okay, I'm seeing that there's a ball of some kind back here. Is this game sports ball? Stanley, I think it's sports ball. Oh, what fun. We shall run the bases and do a touchdown together? Yes, I think surely we must. Okay, Stanley, here's the ball. Have fun. Okay. You know, we always go for orange. Are you doing it? Are you winning? Is this fun? Is it better than my miserable little story that I work so hard on? Stanley, I have a thought. And I realize I'm not a sportsologist, but if one ball generates a certain amount of raw adrenal pleasure, then surely multiple balls makes for an even more euphoric sports experience. I'm going to try it out. I'm Here not comes another ball. Again. Yes. Oh goodness, that really does oh, cool. feel Issue amazing, came doesn't it? There. Stanley, I'm like a child in a confectionery shop. I simply have to have more. I'm insatiable. More balls. Well, 
Let's punch some balls. Uh, yeah. Are you enjoying this? Hiya. Are you having Hiya. fun? Is this a real video game? Yeah, it is. Well, I, sure I love you're hitting having balls. A good time because guess what? It's over. That's what? right. Your little fun comes to an end. This is my game, and what I say goes. You get to have fun when I let you, Stanley. Besides, you need someone like me to set boundaries for you. Without rules or boundaries, video games are nothing. Yes, that's what I am. I'm structure. I'm your sense of purpose. And since you decided you didn't want to play my game, now I don't want to play with you either. So goodbye, Stanley. I'm leaving. See how you like it when I'm not around to set the rules. Some literally I don't think you'll enjoy it as much, but who knows? You're an inventive kid, you'll come up with something. After all, you're the one who knows best. I don't know, in a world like Take this. Take care, Stanley. I can't imagine I'll ha I won't have that much fun. I can understand that the only way out is, uh, here. Staring into the, uh, endless abyss. Oh! Hold on. What are you Wait. doing? Well, we all know where this is going to end. See you next episode? Yeah.